Hi, I'm Olivia Barnes, and I'll be reading my devotional today. Starting at the scripture, Proverbs chapter 4, verses 4 through 7. Lay the hold of my words with all of your heart. Keep my commands, and you will live. Get my wisdom, get understanding. Do not forget my words or swerve from them. Do not forsake wisdom, and she will protect. Love her, and she will watch over you. Wisdom is supreme, therefore get wisdom. Though it costs all you have, get understanding. My observation is that here in the author in Proverbs highlights wisdom. Pursuing wisdom can be seen as difficult in modern times, especially within younger generations. I believe that wisdom should be seen as essential with developing a relationship with Christ. Wisdom should be essential because it builds a stronger foundation and helps you grasp the context of the Bible better. In verse 7, it names wisdom as supreme, which means it should be taken with great value. I believe that all generations should understand the concept of wisdom to benefit their lives with Christ. On application, as someone who is younger, sometimes I tend to be forgetful of the Lord's words. And with this passage, it reminds me to not forget the significance of his words. I constantly need the protection that wisdom lays over me and those around me. My relationship with Christ will strengthen because I know that wisdom is embedded into the foundation of it. Verse 7 reminds us that wisdom may cost all we have, so we must grasp a firm understanding. It may cost relationships with our peers or even our family. But we must remind ourselves of the plan that Jesus has for us. Let's pray. Dear Heavenly Father, I ask that you lay wisdom over us students and families as we return back to school. May you remind us of our strengths and sometimes it may be difficult during the season. I pray for families who have been heavily affected by the coronavirus. And I ask that you give us the wisdom to know that we can come to you with a posture of opportunity and not obligation. In your name I pray, amen.